News of Kyle McCord's decision quickly spread throughout Buckeye Nation and beyond. Certainly, NBC4's Eric Halperin has been speaking to those on campus as well as a sports psychologist. So, Eric, tell us how are they feeling about this? Jen, reaction is all over the place. We don't know exactly what led Kyle McCord to this decision, but the sports psychologist talked to me about all sorts of things college athletes deal with these days, both here in Columbus and around the country. After one season leading the Buckeyes, quarterback Kyle McCord is looking elsewhere. I'm going to be happy with somebody else in the driver's seat. Um, not that I don't think he's going to be a great football player, um, but I think that we could personally use somebody else. Reaction around campus has been mixed. Some caught off guard by the QB's decision. Many wishing him well no matter where he ends up. I feel like Kyle McCord, like, I think he's like a very good quarterback. Um, I think OSU fans can get like a little spoiled, I feel like. But if that's the uh, move that he wanted to make, uh, definitely support him on that. Dr. Chris Stankovich is a professional athletic counselor. It's unclear why exactly McCord decided to enter the transfer portal. Stankovich points to several possible factors college athletes deal with these days. Pressure in cities like Columbus and others, social media, finding the best path to possible professional playing careers, and feeling welcome. Well, I think it was a surprise, but maybe not really a surprise because we're seeing so many student athletes from all different sports today uh, looking at transfer options, and it's a very different landscape today in the NCAA than it was just a few years ago. He also says the relatively new transfer portal and NIL have completely changed the game. The things are happening so fast in real time right now that we don't really know what's going on. I mean, there's controversy over the four teams that were selected. You have an undefeated Florida State that got snubbed. Uh, you're seeing blue chip five star guys transferring. It's a little bit like the wild, wild west right now. I mean, the hope is that it settles in the years ahead, but who knows? And fans here on campus did make one thing clear today, regardless of who's QB next year. They want the season to end on a better note. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Eric Alperin, NBC4.